go. Let the sail out. Touch it. Rampy mentioned this place, the last known location of the summer.
Who goes there? A friend, an ally. I'm looking for the summer army. <laughs> Camp leader is up top. You can't... Saxons caught us without weapons. It's no way to die. <laughs> Hail! What has happened here? Who is asking? Eivor, of the Raven Clan. I have heard the name. You helped the sons of Ragnar overthrow the Mercian king. Well met. Did you and your men fail to take the village? No. No, we had it for a time. It was nothing but a cluster of waterland daub huts when we came. We made it lively. Grantbridge was a thriving hub of trade and song under the care of Soma Ayalskona. But the Saxons took it back. They appeared within the city as if rising from the shadows and drove us out. That is terrible. How were you ambushed? It was like they burst out of the center of the city itself, setting aflame everything in their path, shouting some nonsense about an ancient order of warriors. By the time I saw the fires, too many of us were killed or captured. Our Yalsko Masuma, she bellowed the retreat and we took refuge in the ruins. But in the chaos, we were separated. She and the bulk of our forces fled northeast into the swamps. I'd follow if we were fit to. We need her iron fist. I can find Soma. Be ready when we return. She'll be deep in the fog of the Fenlands by now. Find her longship. That's your best bet. Hate me, be my eyes. This area is off limits. Slaughter them like cattle, too. Shame we have to take prisoners at all. They'll live just long enough to serve as an example to the others. Lord Wigman's wrath is as grand as it is swift. Last 
sweet. If not for the smell of dope, it'd be worth keeping a sack of it for when we're going into battle. <laughs> I'll finish you! Cool nearby. Not here. Shoma dragged the Saxons east from her longship to tire them out and lose them in the fog. Soma. Show me what lies ahead. Take him to the shelter for warmth. Slap some moss in that gash and wrap it well. Egil. Egil, look at me. Remember the boars you felled our first day in England. Hold his arms. Nine. Large and fat. Fed us for a week. Yeah. Yeah. yeah that was... ah! Ah! You'll be chasing more in a month, my friend. You come like a Valkyrie out of the fog. But we have no dead to give you. You must be Soma. Let's talk elsewhere. Give them a chance to rest. Quite a hit you took. How many were lost? It's kind of you to ask, but with so much blood in the water and death on the air, I'd know your name and purpose first. Eivor of the Raven Clan. I came for you, looking for a friend and ally. I see. I'm Soma, Lord of Grandbridge. 
Though it seems an order of lunatics wishes to strip me of that title. The Order of the Ancients? Sounds right. The Saxon called Wigmund is one of them. He robbed me of my city, forced us into these swamps. I've rallied some of my soldiers, but my three advisors are missing. If we hope to retake Grand Bridge, I'll need them at my side. Tell me about them. They are my best, my inner circle. Bilna, Galin, Leave. We may as well be of the same blood. If I can reunite them and retake your city, can I call you a friend and ally? If you can do all that, you can call me whatever you want. Who is this Wickmund? What does he want? He's a flailing elderman under the old king. A bitter man digging his fingernails into Grant Bridge, just to say he can. He's made many attempts to unseat me before. This time he managed a trick. What happened to Granbridge? The elder man Wigman seized it from us. I'm not sure how he managed, but he will not keep it. Not for long. He has supporters outside the city. But this attack seemed to come from inside the walls. From the heart of Granbridge. Let's find your advisors. Agreed. We'll look for signs of their longboats along the river. And if we are swift, we will find them before the wolves do. The fog is more hindrance than hiding place now. Let's light the way back. Go, Zulin. Long and hut, bright wolf of the branch, and guide Soma's gilded warriors home. What must I think? 
that it's foolish to search the Fenlands for so few people. You told me the soldiers you lost were your best, vital to retaking the city. Do you think it's foolish? Not at all. Then why would I? You have the look of one who does well with solitude. You're alone, a wanderer. It may be you think of soldiers as war fodder and little else, but these warriors are more than a blade and shield. They are my family, nothing short. I've lost a city this week. I will not lose them too. I understand. And if your people yet live, we'll find them. So kind. I've had quite the day. Look through the fog, Lee. Follow the beacon. Our camp is at its base. We'll return when we've found the others. Blood for Odin! We'll head straight to the camp and see that everyone's shipshape when you return. Leif is a prim and proper man, isn't he? He lives by a strict code of honor, more than most. And builds the best longships I've ever sailed. They're the reason we escaped. Be my eyes, Sunan. Where was I now? He lives by a strict code of honor, more than most. And builds the best longships I've ever sailed. They're the reason. behind his shackles, wretched carrion beast. I don't deserve this. Leave me! Run! Are you the only one of your people left standing? 
Standing myself with the blessings of Odin and Freya, feasting well with the gods. I've set a camp not far from here, marked by a beacon. Go there, Galen, under cover. Ava and I will find the others. I'll head back to camp, and as I recover, I'll watch over the rest with a care that only Freya knows. Sweeping the hearth outside? We have it just fine. They can go starting a new town. In fact, this house being our first. Follow me. Leave and gather. Eivor, you meet us there when you're ready. Thank you, Soma. And you as well, Sambi. Yeah! 
Hey! I'll teach you how to steer! The beacon has drawn the last of my soldiers. By tomorrow, our strength will have returned, and we can retake our city. I have not yet spoken to Leif, Birna, and Galen about this. After my missteps, I worry what they must think of me. They'll be grateful you risk your life to find them. I would be. By Thor's hammer, I am glad we're together. In spite of our setback. Galen, you look... well worn. Do not grieve the men you lost. They will be singing your praises in the corpse hall, waiting for us. Thank you, Jarl's corner. Leif, you'd outlast any tempest. It's good to be back, Soma. All as one. And know this, that I will follow you through the eye of the storm if you called. Birna. I'm delighted you're alive. I'm delighted to be living. I lost so many after all this, but I still have you three. That makes me the most blessed warrior in Midgard. And Eivor, you have more than proven your worth. Help us reclaim our city, and you will have an ally in me. My blade is yours, for Grandbridge. We'll rest for the night. Gather our strength and our wits. And at the break of dawn's light, we retake Grand Bridge! Pass the night in our camp, Eivor. Take anything you need. Leif, Soma says you're the man who built her longships. That's right. Each has a sharp keel, a stout mast, and a poem etched into the hull to sing the praises of the Dringer who commands her. A longship is heavy with fate. Just a few lengths of wood between you and a watery grave. What better place to put a line of poetry, hmm? Agreed. It's good to fight beside you, Leif. Likewise, Eivor. Thanks again for plucking me and my warriors from the mire. Garlan, is that right? That's right. And you are Eivor, the infinite fighter, or forever warrior. It's a glorious name. Many thanks. You were in a tight spot when we found you. Indeed. The Saxons pursued me, ran me bloody through the swamps and into the lap of bandits. And the wolves came. We all have our one day, the day we die. How you greet that day is all that matters. I'm proud to say that I was ready. Well, it's good to see you breathing still. You're of Vienna. And you are Eivor's sunbeam. You cut through the fog like the sun burns through ice. You're in high spirits, all things considered. The ambush, losing your home. In this moment, yes. But ah, you feel that? The moment has passed. 
We are free to pursue the next. What a gift! It's good to have you in this fight, Vienna. I like you, Eivor. You may help me here, or step on me. And by the look of you, I'd welcome either. Pierced my boy through his heart. He hadn't seen his 16th summer. Ah, we'll make him pay the blood debt. Him and all <clears> his <throat> Saxon allies. The day is new, and the air is bracing. Are you ready for the fight ahead? Let's take your city back. That's what I like to hear. Meet me at the western gate of Grantbridge. We've assembled there. Have care you do not enjoy taking orders from anyone but your Jarl back home. I fight for Sigurd, none else. While you're on this ship, Dag, you fight for me, and for Soma's loyalty. We fight for her. Let's go. Sail out! Sail out. Pick up. Two teams hidden, one on each side of the door. Turn Grantbridge to me, Wigmund. No more of our people need die. We may talk this out, lord to lord. Ha! <laughs> what are we to talk about? You have nothing I need. Worth by birth, even. I was born a noble. You were plucked from a giant's armpit. I built this town. From a mud hut to a thriving port. And we both know you'll bleed those riches dry without my guiding hand. Leave! Go die in the muck where you belong, heathens! Wigman, Wigman, let's try one final time! Quit Grantbridge! And when she is mine once more, I may spare your life! Ha! I command Grantbridge! I am master here! And I will scour you rats from this land like rot from a festering wound! Let me give you some advice, old bear! The surest way to stop a wound from festering isn't with a blade. It's with fire. Yeah! Now, Danes of Brandenburgshire, we take what is yours! What has Whitman done to us? No time for that. We must free her first. We'll surely find him there. Death! There! Get the 
heathen dog! No prisoners, no mercy. Get outside! No uh, words for that! Uh, me forever. Come face your death. Heathen eels. Wigmund is gone. He's gone. <laughs> Any man who fights for Wigmund by ship or plane. You funk. I'll be ready to turn I'm up. No sign of Wickman here. He may be hiding within the city walls. Shall we search? No. He'll be gone. Count on it. Arger coward. But we've struck a bold claim today. Walk with me. I want you to sound our battle horn to announce our victory. Let all the Shire know that Grandbridge is retaken. The sound of the horn means prosperity, long life, bounty. Why me? Why not? You were the keystone to this attack. You turn the tide. Let the wind from your lungs breathe life back into my city.
My clan throws the best feasts, I think you'll find. You enjoy yourself? I did. But were you celebrating or mourning? You looked unsure. The night of the attack, I heard sounds of bloodshed coming from the Longhouse. In moments, the city was overrun with Saxons, so I called a retreat. We all have our one day, but not like that. Not that day. I've heard this before, that the Saxons appeared as if from the shadows. In all my time in Grantbridge, this tunnel was my most careful project. The best kept secret in the city. Now a hundred or more Saxons know the smell of it. The only people who knew about this tunnel were me, and the three in my inner circle. You believe you were betrayed? I know I was. By whom? That is where I hesitate. Between Leif, Galen, and Birna, I cannot say. But they are the three who helped me dig this in secret. I hoped you might lend me your wits. You are a fresh ally. I could use your eyes and ears. I promised you I'd help secure your city. That task is near done, it seems. Good. I sent Galen, Leif, and Birna to destroy what remains of Wigman's power throughout the Shire. Meet with them. Raid with them. Get to know them as best as you can. Find out which of them betrayed me. A betrayal so wicked, I cannot imagine. Yet someone willing to break an oath like that must bear some sign or defect. I need clear, sound judgment. I need you, Eivor. You have me. Thank you. Feel free to take a look around as you wish. Search the city, the tunnel. And here, a gift, for retaking Grandbridge with us. One of the few things I have left from my blood family. This tunnel leads to the Longhouse. The traitor marked it with a yellow cross, then opened the way and let them in. The traitor must have exited here with a few more, heading away towards the riverbank. A trail of yellow paint drops.
blasted, cursed, horrible... Tough lands, old man? Those rats. I tried everything. I poured lye, I harvested locusts, I hired children to kill them. I need an army of miracles. They are pesky, and have ravaged your good crop. No, the gods can't get at rats. Ha! You heathens and your gods! All I want is to rid my field of rats. Feed the fair folk of the Shire. You need natural warriors to keep them at bay. Blasted, cursed, horrible rats. My poor fields. God, why did you send so much vermin? Rats, be gone! <laughs> Blasted, cursed, horrible rats! <laughs> My poor fields. God, why did you send so much vermin? My poor fields. God, why did you send so much vermin? Blasted, cursed, horrible rats! Someone hauled this bucket of yellow paint all the way down to the riverbank. They quickly painted a longship beached here. Then they sailed off, with allies to help crew the vessel. My poor fields. God, why did you send so much vermin? Shoot! Shoot! Stay away! I feel your army of cats have a destiny unrealized. You are a Freya of the Fens. What? Who the hell is Freya? 
Is she the whore that tried to eat my cat queen last week? She is a goddess, much like you, with pious and mighty cats that help her fight. Show your claws, good lady. Oh, yes. Mighty. That is what they are. And me, their goddess. Hmm. If you want, use this key and see for yourself. Oh, my pretty babies. There you are. Head to the fields. Tat tat. Fight your battle. Cats are sacred beings. They help keep harmony. Your rat problem has been taken care of. Pray to Freya. I never thought the meow of cats could soothe my soul. Take this key. In my house I have some goods. Please help yourself.
The markets are up and running again. Soma doesn't waste time. Closer. What do you want? You look to be a good fighter, but do you dare to face the greatest battle you will ever know? Of what do you speak? I speak of a terrible and monstrous incorporeal power whose name is feared across these lands. Fergal the Faceless, the most fearsome flighter in all of Grantbridgeshire. Oh, oh. a flighter, is that all? Fergal the Faceless has silenced doubters before. Will you challenge him? I will face the Faceless. <gasps> My God! You are braver than most. Or perhaps more foolish. Come, I will give you a key. This key unlocks Fergal's lair, which you see now before you. That is a house. No, no. It is a den of nightmares. A pit of death from which few have ever escaped unharmed. By words. Unharmed by words. Go. Go now. And God be with you. A new victim? What fool dares to challenge the might of Fergal the Faceless? Eivor of the Raven Clan. Eivor of the Raven Clan? My next meal. Are you prepared to be eviscerated with words? I think I will survive. I am Fergal the Faceless, and I am clever and strong. But you're not. You're ugly and weak, and you're a big smelly coward. You're probably too scared to even face me, now that I think about it. Sorry, have you started? Yes, obviously. I said you're probably too scared to face me. But your rhythm is clumsy. You will never outpace me. Ah, you think you can win with rhyme, do you? Well, if you like to rhyme, listen this time. I'm very brave. My flighting is grave. I'm not a knave, and it's victory that I really crave. Your tongue is fat. You're a sprat. You whine like a little brat. And we are in a spat. has never been so weak an insult as that. Oh, you've made a terrible mistake. Be ready for my finishing blow. I am the best at flighting. I have got powerful skills. I'm strong as an ox and clever as a fox. I'm sharp as a dozen hawks. Let me show you my skills, and then you I shall kill dead with my... my skill.
If we are arguing as to your talent, I shall happily die on this hill. You... Uh, well... I... Uh, just one moment. I, I... I need to think. Give me time. Ferkel the faceless or Ferkel the wordless? No, you get ready. The killing blow is... It's coming. It's... Fergal? Hello? Soma, to understand your people well, I should better know you. If I can find your traitor, what will you do with them? They will die by my hand. No pain, no public humiliation. A traitor or no, the bastard is also one of my closest people. My friend, my family. Only I will bear the burden of causing their death. It will not muddy the minds of any other. That is enough. That's all. Good luck, Eivor. Thank you for doing this. <laughs> 